So this is one of the most interesting topic batteries. So if you see here we are going to discuss about primary batteries, secondary batteries, fuel cells and corrosion. So this is the depiction of a battery. In general we knew that a battery will charge by itself. So this is all about the primary batteries which you can able to see it over here. And this is the depiction of the secondary batteries and this is how it will be the secondary batteries. And this is the depiction of corrosion. So you can see here some of the objects which has the corrosion in it. So let us see how the molten metal battery is. So this is how the molten metal battery will be and it has this reaction which goes on. So if you see here on both the terminals we have one side by Mg that is metal magnesium and by one side Sb that is antimony. Similarly we have Li lithium with a combination of antimony and lead. So this is how it reacts. So inside the molten metal battery the reaction will be like this. So this is a sample depiction. So if you see about batteries, any battery or cell that we use as a source of electrical energy is basically a galvanic cell where the chemical energy of the redox reaction is converted into electrical energy. However, for a battery to be practical use, it should be reasonably light, compact and its voltage should not vary appreciably during its use. There are mainly two types of batteries. The first one is primary batteries and secondary batteries. So you can see here how the primary battery and secondary battery is all about. 